Hi everyone, the blogger here with another edition of the blog. And today we're going to be reviewing this the spaghetti with meat and textured soy flour protein. Nutritional facts packed by Sapoco packing. The list of ingredients, you guys can pause it and read that if you want. Now this is a civilian MRE, low sodium. It got a pillable seal, nice thick clear plastic. Let's hop into it and see what we have. Now it does have the inner wrapping upon wrapping. So let's just Get that off. And then we have our spaghetti. Sorry guys, little plug issues here. Okay. Then we have our crackers. We have some apple jelly, some more apple jelly, a lot of apple jelly, the date code of 6227, and we got some Pop-Tarts, some toaster pastry, brown sugar, not my favorite, but it'll do, got a delicious Tootsie Roll, we have our flameless ration heater. Our accessory pack, it comes with pepper and non-salt seasoning, napkin and a spoon, and the cardboard sleeve. Okay, and since this doesn't come with a drink, I decided to add this. This is jet and uh, jasmine tea. There's an herbal tea from China. Or San Francisco, really. Kind of town, <laughs> but it'll do the trick, it'll be good. So, let me get some water, I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, I'm back. I had to get a little bit of water for the FRH, so let's get that peel open. That pan moved up. Uh, FRH, I mean, uh, spaghetti. Sorry, guys. Put it on the back side, I guess. Like that. Okay. Pop it into the sleeve. So, this should be a fairly new FRH. Too, so. Get the fill line out so I can wash the water in there. Yeah, uh, according to the thing, it's the 277th day of 2016 on the pop part. So, just pour some water in there. Got to the fill line. Over. I want to get that pad nice and saturated. It is starting to get hot, you guys. See the steam coming off? Yeah, there we go. Nice and saturated that pad. All right. And we will put that on a rock or something, which is going to be over here next to my tea kettle. Okay. Get our accessory pack open real quick. Get that little paper, well, thinner than paper, paper towel. Clean our tray real quick. Got the little water on it, but that's okay. 
a spoon, nice strong durable spoon. Our Pappy's Perfect seasoning and our pepper. Okay. Now, let's get these crackers open. Got a nice little hiss. Oops. <laughs> Just regular crackers, no salt. Standard US MRE crackers. <laughs> got some apple jelly, and got two packs, but I'm only going to use one for the purpose of this video. Don't need both of them. I would have enjoyed having some peanut butter instead of just jelly, you know. Oh, it's coming out like honey. But it's apple jelly. So we're going to try that. Put the apple jelly there. And then we'll get into our toaster pastries, or AKA Pop Tarts. This side has the terrace seals on them. Yep. Frosted Pop Tarts, brown sugar. Oh, and they're open. Oh, <laughs> I tore it open an accident. I thought that was bad for a second, but it's just the packaging, faulty packaging guys. There's supposed to be two of them in here, but there's only one, and it's freaking kind of crammed together. Okay, so I'm not going to try and, you know, mess with that too much. Clean my tray up, you guys. And let's make our tea, our jasmine herbal tea. The tea may come from China, and you know, it's just packaged in San Francisco and everything like that. I think. I don't know. But, uh, there we go. Dip that a couple of times. Oh yeah. Jasmine tea is one of my favorite, you guys. One of my favorite. Bought some sugar here in the kitchen. It's a communion sugar jar, so one and about a half spoonfuls of sugar. Because I don't believe it needs much. You know? Crash out of my way. Give that a good stir. And we'll let that steep. Soak, whatever you want to call it. Our Tootsie Roll. Now, Tootsie Rolls are a controversial thing. You either like them or you don't. There's no in between. Tootsie Rolls are a chocolate taffy. Kind of like a caramel chocolate taffy. Very malleable, tough, but easy to chew. You can shape it and whatever. Now they put in this cardboard sleeve because when it comes out, it's very hot. So this helps it keep its shape and then just go all over the place. But that's a tissue roll. And we'll be right back once our mill has been heated up. Okay, you guys, we're back. It's been heating up for a while. And it's still very, very, very hot. Ah! That is freaking roaring hot. I've never had a flameless ration either work this good on me before. That is a quality one. So, Paco, you need to do the inward stuff. Get wiped off a little bit. Has this sideways pteranoxus. And like always, 
they never like to tear for me. That's when we go to our trusty dusty knife. Make a small incision. And voila. We have access to spaghetti. So, it smells very interesting. It doesn't smell like typical spaghetti. I'm guessing it's because of the textured vegetable proteins mixed with meat. Man, that's... Ah. I'm sorry, you guys. The sauce is burning my fingers. Very, very hot. Wow, I've never had one <laughs> this flaming hot before. Wow. That's amazing, guys. I like... Really amazing. Wipe down my spoon. Okay. Now, we will try it by itself on its own. You know, if it does, we'll add the seat. If it needs it, we'll add the seasonings to it. But yeah, this looks good. Hmm. Wow. Ah. Uh, that tastes bad. I mean, you can't even really taste meat. All you taste is that vegetable protein. Oh my gosh. I've never tasted spaghetti like that. Let's go ahead and add our Pappy's Perfect Seasoning to the mix. Even the texture is a little off. Pepper. Don't give you much pepper. It's supposed to be a low sodium, not low pepper milk, <laughs> but you know, whatever. Give that a good mix. Look, on, focus. There it goes. Nice. Mm. Mm. That still, still didn't do much for it. Still has an off taste. Oh my gosh. Let's go to a pop tart. I did manage to put them apart with my knife off camera. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the outer crust off there so we get to the filling part. Is that a good taste? Yeah, it tastes like an oversweet paste pastry. Oops. Sorry about that, you guys. I'm going to have some extra flavor on that piece. But let's gun dog it up a little bit. Put some of this apple going on, making apple cinnamon pastry. Mm-hmm. That's really what you gotta do, you guys. That apple makes it pop better. I guess that's why I give you two. Some for your toaster pastries and some for your crackers. But now I'm gonna have to taste this with spaghetti on it. Mm. The brown sugar and the pastry overpower the flavor of the spaghetti stuff by a mile you came and came and taste it on there but this is one ounce bag of jelly mm. not super super delicious let's move to our cracker first I'm going to try it without this piece broke off guys see there it is I didn't bite it Mm. 
And this actually tastes a little bit better than your standard MRE cracker. Military one it actually tastes like a regular cracker without salt. Because you know how the military ones taste kind of floury. But yeah. Now we'll do it with the jelly. I think it's all right without the crack. I mean, the jelly. Um, I'll save that for the pop tart. But cracker, we'll just you know do a little bit more like this. Give this stuff a little bit of texture, a little bit depth of flavor. Add the cracker to it, and we'll see how that tastes. Get some cracker on there. Mm. Oh my gosh, that still does not help that spaghetti. That spaghetti, I don't know how to describe it. Hold on, you guys. Hold on. Okay, guys, I had to run to my kitchen, get some hot sauce and some salt. I am sorry. I know it's supposed to be a low sodium meal, but damn. Sorry, excuse my language, but. Oh my gosh, it's just, the flavor is just bad. Get some hot sauce and some salt on there. It remind me, if you're on a low sodium diet, that's fine for you. If you like no flavor and bad textures, but. Let me give that a second bite, guys. Nope. Not at all. Not even salt and hot sauce could save that. In my opinion, oh no. That is some gross, gross stuff. I need to take a drink of my tea over here. Still hot. Good. Has a good... Good jasmine tea. Ah, uh, tutti roll. Now, tutti rolls are kind of tough and chewy sometimes. But, overall, I think they're very delicious. But like I said, some people like them, some people don't. I want to thank you all for watching, and do come back, we're at 46 subscribers, we're almost to 50. Once we do, I'll be giving away that MRE, which I'll show next time, I left it in the other room, so. Thank you guys for watching, please come back for more. I'm sorry, this spaghetti with meat and textured soy flour did not taste so good. Mm-mm. This, oh my gosh. So Paco, what are you doing to people? I want to thank y'all again. Come back for watch our 50 subscribers. Thank you to everyone who supports the channel, Magnus, you know, Polly MRE reviews and things. Anyone else who watches, likes, subscribes. I want to thank y'all and see you next time.